Hi, I am CD Mwabweze, your rural news tour guide. Let me show you what they showed me and please believe this story. The Kulanot plays a major role in the way diverse African cultures welcome people to their communities. Rural news tourism took us to Ozoro in Isoko North local government area of Delta State where we witnessed the way elders welcome people to the community. The excitement began when we arrived at Ozoro and then lodged in a very nice hotel in the community. Nice hotel in Ozoro and I've come to look at the culture of people here in Ozoro. I then took off in the evening to see some elders of the community before embarking on my mission to investigate their exciting cultures. Hi, I'm in Osoro, the headquarters of Isoko North Local Government area of Delta State. And I've come here for one of the assignments on rural news tourism and the culture is fantastic. Just follow me as we learn from their culture. They will have to welcome me first before I start my mission. In the community, my friends took me to their house and their mom took all of us to the community center where we met some elders that welcomed me officially through the breaking of Kola North and goodwill prayers for me. All the elders present prayed in different ways, but one of them started by representing me, and that is how it's done in their culture, one we pray on your behalf and then the other one we pray after you have presented whatever brought you to the community for them to assist you. First of all, everyone put money in a plate to support the cola nut that was brought before us. They had to put money in a plate alongside the cola nut and then present it to me before the ray prayers began. The woman who owns the shop where we were also put money in the plate to support the entire process.
They then presented the money to me. I took the money and then dropped some money back in the plate also as a sign of goodwill before the elder that was representing me now prayed. Actually, you don't need to know the elder. The fact is, the person that brought you to the circle knows the elder and the elder stands in for you and prays in their language. Let's listen to the prayer session over the Kolanot. After the initial session of prayer, you now place money in a plate and then present your case. But this is the first session of prayer to welcome me. Much later, you will see when I now presented money and then and then another elder prayed before I was then accepted to begin my mission in the land which was on rural news tourism. I remember what you got I The liquid you are seeing in that bottle is nothing close to Coca-Cola or any soft drink. It is a kind of hot drink called Ogogoro. It often accompanies cola nuts in certain parts of Isoko land. When it came to my turn to drink, I took just a quick sip thinking that all was over. Then what I felt next was fire inside me. I mean fire. I then wondered how others were drinking it as if it was harmless bottled water. Throughout the next 30 minutes, I felt like I needed two bags of sachet water to cool down my system. Uh -huh. 
When they present Kolano to you in Isoko land, they support it with money. Sometimes they place money under the plate that contains the kola knot, and that is to wage the kola knot. It is believed that if money is not used to wage the kola knot, the kola knot might jump out from the plate. So when you get kola knot, you get money in the plate too, and then the visitor takes the money. But if the visitor has come for something, maybe if he's not even a visitor, maybe from the land. But you had a complaint for the elders. But if you came for something, then after the first set of prayers, you have to put back money in the plate and then give back to the elders. After which they will pray and then they commence listening to your case. <laughs> Okay. Anomare 